Okay. Hi, good morning, you guys. We're going to get right into it. I still have four packages waiting to be unboxed, so we are going to, without delay, get started in today's video. I had some hype music on, if you could hear. I love that song, Peanut Butter Jelly. So, hi. I got all caught up with, um, everybody emailed me this week, and I got all caught up with prizes, with the exception of one, it looks like one from um, the 15th. If you won on January 15th, I've still been holding on to your prize here, but I will probably restock the, um, hi Vicky. I probably will restock the prizes so that they're not sitting here in my space after this week. So just last call. If you won, I don't want to call out names, but if you won on the 15th, it was a week of a lot of grab bags and you haven't, um, emailed me yet, please email me this week and I can send that to you. Otherwise I'm just going to restock and we're just going to move on because it's been a month. So, um, but I'm all caught up with everything else. So I'm really excited about that. We are going to have a couple grab bags today. We have China Glaze, the China Glaze Mystic mystic spring no mystic bloom collection to do a giveaway with the morgan taylor full bloom collection did you guys watch those videos do you have any thoughts i anticipated liking the china glaze collection more than i did um i still think you should watch the video and see how they apply before you make any decisions but um yeah i just I felt a certain way about it. Hi. Hi, everybody. I left my glasses upstairs, but it's okay. Melissa, hi. Hi, Candace, Kayla, Liz, Erin, Kristen, Quila, Jerry, Nicole, Louise is here, Vicki, and another Nicole, all my Nicole bays. And we have Cherry Blossom. Hi, Rachel. Hi. Hey, Jackie. So I am opening the um, 2022 duo from Polish for Days, guys. This is one of the packages that's been sitting over there for a little minute. And I always have to order her New Year's Duo. I wasn't particularly attracted to the colors of this one as much as I was like last year. Her New Year's Duo last year was some of my favorite indie polishes I tried all year. Um, but because based upon the fact that how much I loved last year's, I was like, okay, I have to get this year. So... And I saw everybody wearing it, wearing them, and I was like, wait a second, I ordered those. Do you guys ever do that where you order something and then a while it goes by and you're like, wait a second, did I ever receive that? Where was that order? Yeah, I did receive it. It was sitting over there. So we have this bright greeny gold shimmer. Let's open that. This one's called 2022. And it has a lot of blue in it, but like a really strong green gold shimmer. I think this is the same one um, from Hello Green um, with a blue base. Pretty, pretty, pretty. And it's going to be like really, really glowy because that's how she does her year, her year polishes, the ones that are named after the year. And then... This polish was kind of the reason why I wasn't sure like if I needed the the duo because it's a black jelly. It actually looks a lot like um, My Tomorrows Are All Yours. And so I thought, oh, well, I'll just wear My Tomorrows Are All Yours. And then, of course, I convinced myself to buy it because it's nail polish and, you know, that's just what I do. So they're Celestial and 2022. So we'll open, we'll uh, swatch those. Hey, Jessica's here, Tammy. Hi. I'm going to say hi to everybody. So we have Robins here. Hey, Chrissy, your package is on the way. Carly, Miss Shay, Katya, hi. Yours is on the way too. Val, Anna Maria, hi. Bivoleya, did I say that anywhere close to how it should be said? <laughs> Probably not. Kayla, hi. You really liked half of the China Glaze collection. Always the greens, blues, and purples, says Kristen. Um, although actually I didn't care for the, <laughs> the green and the blue that much. Um, you finally, oh, yay, Vicky. The dark one is pretty. This one. 
I will swatch it. I shall. I shall do it today. They are pretty, huh? Please swatch them today. Okay, cool. Hi, Debbie. Miranda's here. Miranda in the house. Miranda in the house. Cammy, your package is on the way to you. Awesome. You're welcome. Hi, Janine. Okay, friends. So let's open one more package. Actually, I'm going to open another package from Polish for Days. <laughs> Guys, this is the um, For the Love of Polish. Okay. <gasps> Look at that green. Ooh. That's going to kind of be the shade of the green for the polished um, gamers box. That Animal Crossing. I'm going to make that green you guys were talking about. Oh, I just finished making April's collection and I'm in love with it. So I'm like in a super good, happy, creative mood. Tim took the girls to the dog appointment yesterday and the boys were at school and I had the house quiet and able to like productively work for probably like six straight hours. And it put me in such a good mood because I love having my kids and husband home and with me all the time. And I'm going to miss Joy so much when she goes to full day next year. But it's just really kind of startling to always like be stopping and starting when you're trying to get work done. So it was just delightful. So here is the theme was, um, oh shoot. What was the theme you guys? It was just so cute. I had to get it. Choco cat cinema roll. And hop to it. I'm going to... Karopi, is that the name of this little character that hop to it is inspired by? I know I'm going to say that wrong and offend those of you who are super fans of this topic. But I just... These are like the three colors I don't need more of in my collection at all. But I just had to. They were so darling. You love Fair Maiden's Greens? Ooh. Snowstorm in Canada. Hi, Marlene. You have a heated blanket on. Wonderful. My mom doesn't watch any of my videos, so I can safely tell you that I sent her a giant heated blanket for her birthday on Monday, and I'm really excited. I hope she loves it. Oh, Vicki, I'm glad you're enjoying that. Thank you for your order. You're buried in blankets watching Dokus. What's Dokus? My golem voice? Did I? Oh, <laughs> I was like, what did I do? <laughs> I never can remember the stuff I did. It's cold. Good morning, everyone. Yes. Good morning. Hi, Shelly. Leslie. Hi, boo. Who else did I miss? Sanrio. Thank you, Shelly. Sanrio. Karopi is the frog. Okay. Oh, Tim and Salem. Doing better. <laughs> Until yesterday, Tim was like, I got sick again yesterday. Not me. He said that. And I'm like, what the heck? This guy can't catch a break. But we have Honor's um, 10th birthday party to go to today. It's at like one of these family fun places. And my kids are going to be doing go-karts and mini golf and laser tag. So he's got to somehow figure out how to have the energy to do this. Although if I go do it by myself... 10 year olds like 10 10 year olds is going to be much easier for me to manage than 26 year olds that party was difficult and drained me but I think I'll be okay if I end up going by myself today I hope that I don't because everything's better with Tim you've seen this green in a lot of d-stashes already I just barely ordered it <laughs> guys I don't follow any d-stashes if you see a good d-stash you should like tag me in it or whatever <laughs> says the nail polish hoarder <laughs> I subscribed to um discovery plus recently because my eyelash lady loves that it was like her favorite streaming service so I checked it out and there's so much good stuff there because I love HGTV we love the food network we love the history channel it has like all the stuff we like a bunch of the shows that I'm unacquainted with are like from the TLC channel so we tried 90 90 what's it called 90 day 90 day fiance we tried that it is interesting 
Um, but what, what did that make me think of just now? Oh, hoarders. So I have to admit, I am a person who enjoys watching hoarders. It puts me in like a, let me de-stash, let me declutter, let me clean out my life kind of mood, which I really, really love. Um, so I watched the most recent season that they had on there. Yeah, Chrissy, my thought too. I think that there's like de-stash Instagram accounts and stuff. Hi, Bora Bora. Hi, Kim. Good to see you. Hey, Goddess Solara. Hey, Michelle. Woot woot. Michelle, how do you like this color for the glowing Animal Crossing? Kim, how do you like this color? I'm thinking like maybe a little more yellowy though. Anyway. Hi, Tika. Tika, I just sent you your stuff today without getting an email from you. I'm just praying that you haven't moved. <laughs> You didn't miss anything, Eva. I opened a couple packages and then I just have been sitting here gabbing. So, so far we haven't opened any red. So I'm going to keep going until I find a red, hopefully. So I have a package from Fancy Gloss because, was it Nicole that was like, hey, look, there's a, a 2.0 version of that polish you wanted. So I ordered from Fancy Gloss and I picked up two things, it looks like. Um... Ooh, she has a pink packing slip. That's fun. Fun, 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 fun. So, I'm more greens because, you know, <laughs> I need more greens. I mean, is this the thermal? Because it would be so awesome if it was just this polish, but it's going to shift. <gasps> oh, I'm so glad whoever it was that told me to get this. Was it Nicole? Oh, Good golly, Miss Molly. January Facebook exclusive retires on Monday. You are so right. It retires on Monday. You can see a sneak peek if you want. Um, this is the other one I got. I don't remember why. Is this a thermal? Strike class. I don't know what this shifts to. Maybe clear, but we'll have to try it. Still no reds. We'll have to open the last package. This is my last package to open, and we are caught up with unboxing until more stuff comes in the mail this week. Because I ordered from I ordered from Polish Pickup, and then it's always back to back to back because it goes Polish Pickup, and then HHC opens, and then Polish Gamers box a day after that. Okay, so I don't know if there's going to be any reds in here. This is from Polish. This is like the drinking game. Every time Phoebe opens a green polish, take a drink. Um, <laughs> Jungle Book sample batch. Okay. It looks divine. Another green polish that I will absolutely love. Another blue polish. Oh, it's the sister to this one. Look how cute. I love it when you find the sisters. Um, so this one has like that strong pink shimmer, as you can see, and this one has like this beautiful gold copper. They're almost the same color in the base. This one's deeper. And then, oh, this is a mystery. I didn't know I ordered a mystery. <gasps> so fun. I honestly just forget what I order you guys. Um, this one's another mystery. Okay. Let's see what the mystery is. Oh my purple. <laughs> This is the other mystery. Okay, so I basically opened four packages and didn't get one single red polish. So um, that's cool. That's cool, 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 cool. And this is the other little olives. Oh, this is why I went to her website was to get her olive polish from the Olive Polish Facebook group. Okay, another green. Well, we're pretty much flush on greens. Who did I miss coming in? Hi, Nicole. You should do a straight green swatch hand today comparing your purchases. Uh, I like to try to do a little something for everybody. Connie's here and she loves the Jungle Book one. Yay. Jessica, did I say hi? Alien, hi. And you have a snow emoji. Are you getting snow right now? All right, so that means I have to pull out my own red polish. And it's going to be this one. Classic Red Lips from the Marilyn Monroe Morgan Taylor Collection. 
which Angie actually gifted me this whole collection. And then I didn't end up swatching it because I wasn't sure if it was available anymore. Like, I didn't swatch it for a review, I mean. So, but it looks gorgeous. And if you didn't watch their spring collection review yet, the collection is beautiful. And their creams are always just so, so good. Beautiful. I don't know. I don't know if that's looks like a maybe it's not quite bright enough I don't know okay next is pink what am I doing we gotta start the first giveaway okay so speaking of Morgan Taylor let's do that one first so it just to make it really confusing because that's not the order that I put the videos up this week but it's fine so we're gonna do the Morgan Taylor one right now first. So if you win this giveaway, you're gonna pick your top two polishes from that collection and um, email me. So you're gonna email me at Moonshine Manny Contact. Oh, Tim just sent me his Wordle score. I've been killing it at Wordle this week. Just saying. I think I found the good secret. My first word and then my second word that don't repeat any letters really make it pretty good. Okay. So what was I saying? Let's start a new notepad and then I'm going to read you the rules. Do, 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 do. Today's the 19th. We're going to start with Morgan Taylor. Helps me so much to just read the rules that Yvette wrote for me many moons ago. So let me just do that so that nobody is confused. And if this is your first time to a giveaway, welcome. We've had a quite a few first time winners recently. Okay, so it says, please switch to live chat. You must be 18 years or older to play or have your parents permission because when you email me at moonshinemanycontact at gmail.com, you're gonna be giving me your address so I can send you your winnings. Choose one number between one and 100 for each drawing. There will be five drawings today. Um, you may choose the same number for every giveaway or change it, but once you choose the number for the occurring giveaway, even if someone else chose the same number, stick with it. That seems to be the rule that most people um, maybe have a little trouble with it, with it. Otherwise, you guys are always so good about all these rules, but just pick one number. You can't erase it and pick a new number. You have to stay with it, even if somebody else has the same number. No erasing or multiple number submissions are allowed. I'm going to type go and then stop. The number has to be within those comments. The winner will be the closest number to the random number generators pick without going over. We all might see different orders of the entries. That depends on the internet and cannot be controlled. It's the majority rules as to who the winner is. But Louise will be the tiebreaker if the majority is tied. Um, thank you to Louise, our moderator, for this video. And I think that's everything. So just have fun. Just have fun. Doing a little... Um, doing a little have your bingo time your lottery win your your little gambling without having to pay any money so doesn't hurt okay there next i'm gonna actually type the word go so okay so here is your go and this will be for morgan taylor thank you kayla kayla put the address uh my email address in so for the pink polish, I'm going to swatch this wild fuchsia with lots of blue shimmer. And it is called I Blow Stuff Up. It's from Hella Handmade Creations December. I blow stuff up. Hella Handmade Creations is still open, you guys. Oh my gosh. I knew this was going to be awesome. I knew it. Look how beautiful. What? What? Amazing. Okay, if I can get the lid on. Now I need orange. That's always a little hard to come by. Nope, that's pink. Kind of orange not really but we're gonna pretend this is from paradox polish and it is called make like a tree and leave 
which is I'm sure probably why I bought this polish. It is so twinkling with holographic glitters and it is a rose. Uh, this multi-chrome goes all the colors of the rainbow. Bravo paradox. It's at the extreme angles that I'm getting the blue and the purple, but in the bottle, I can see every color of the rainbow. Wow. The majority of the colors are like a bronzy copper uh, pink that you can see. You're ready for that shade. Yes. Yes. Hi, Amy. Hi, Miss J. <laughs> I blow stuff up as aptly named. That's so funny. Look in the coverage too. Wow. She's such a baller. That was from Phoenix, by the way. If you haven't tried Phoenix yet, I will be surprised if you shop Polish Pickup and you haven't tried Phoenix yet, but give it a go. Okay, Paradox Polish. You beautiful creature, you. This is going to be a one coater because we, again, have another baller right here. One coats sometimes make it tricky to see all the shimmer you have or see... Um, all the glitter the way you want it to. That's the only reason not like not to make everything a one coater. So on the nail, I'm getting through the green, but not the blue and the purple, but that's okay. I saw it in the bottle. <laughs> it's very shifty. No, Siri, I'm not talking to you. Okay, one more. This, we're gonna, yeah, this is yellow. This is fine, it's yellow. It's kind of like a golden bronze. This is from cupcake polish and it's called it's fall y'all it's fall y'all this one's gonna stain my nails but i'm not gonna leave it on my nails very long so i'm not gonna wear base coat if you're planning to wear any manicure over two days just base coat it up no matter what color it is hey al michelle and riley you don't have you oh well it's the same brand yeah same brand if you didn't know, Phoenix is the same brand as EDK. So if you've tried EDK, you've tried Phoenix. That's what you guys told me, at least. And I'm pretty sure it's right. <laughs> really pretty golden hollow. It's kind of grungy. Uh-oh, we paused. There we go. We're back. And we're back from our space. Bear because stress housework dresser assembly. Oh, oh. Carly says, what's everyone wearing on their nails? Today she's wearing Spice Souk by Cadillacer. I don't think I got that one. I think that one was on my, bought it for the name tag, yeah. I think I bought, I had it on my list and then it sold out, I think, with that one. Hi, Victoria. Okay, so here's your stop for the Morgan Taylor giveaway. You love the grunge. Yes, babe. Hi, Bianca. Okay. So for the first giveaway, we're already at 23 minutes into this video. We're getting to the first giveaway. Here we go. 89 with a rich, ooh, a rich violet indigo purple. Beautiful indigo on the bottom to violet on the top. Okay, while you guys look and see who's the winner. Look, I pretty much have one whole hand of one coders. Isn't that awesome? So this first one, if you're just joining us, was Morgan Taylor Classic Red Lips from the Marilyn Monroe Collection. Now that I have the two coats on, I like this better for like a classic red lip, but I think it needs to be like a little spicier or something. There's a little too much white in it for me for a classic red lip. Still beautiful though. Oh no, internet's telling me that we don't have good connection right now. It's sunny outside. There's no reason my internet should be interrupted. Okay, second coat of Phoenix I Blow Stuff Up, which I don't love pinks, but I saw this one and I was like, my jaw dropped. So, had to have it. Princess Peach wins 89 on the peach. <laughs> Okay, let me put this down. Yay, Princess Peach. Woo! Okay. Awesome. Next giveaway is going to be China Glaze. Let me finish swatching these ladies, though. Hi, Diana. 
Debbie's wearing KB shimmers. I'm so over it because I'm so over our yo-yo weather. Oh, Debbie. Is it like you just get ready to go have an outside day and then you have bad weather? This polish is so glowy, you guys. Oh my gosh. I know I have a, a few colors now that are just pretty much just like this, but this one is particularly glowy. I think that she might have actually added iridescent shimmer on top of the multi-chrome shimmer. Sometimes that will make the shift extra, extra glowy. And look at that happy emoji from Princess Peach. She's so happy. Princess Peach, do you love pinks? Because there's three pinks in that collection and one beautiful mauve. And then there's two, wait. There's three pinks, yeah. Maybe there's not a mauve in that collection. What am I thinking of? Let me just look at the picture. Um, yeah. Why was my counting so bad? I'm like, I can't count. Three pinks, one mauve, and two beautiful greens. One is like a barely green. It still says that I have bad internet right now. I'm sorry, guys. I don't know why. Why the interwebs? So, it's buffering a lot. Sorry, guys. The red-pink berry color on the pinky finger is like the perfect strawberry-raspberry hybrid. On the fourth finger, you mean? This one? Ooh, buddy. Ooh, buddy. Do you know if that Paradox Polish Multichrome is still available or was it part of PPU or it, it was? PPU from October. Sorry. So sorry. So sorry. Okay. All right, we're going to start the second giveaway. So this one is for China Glaze. Let me show you. The Mystic Bloom Collection. Both of these collections are for sale at polishpick.com. These are only $3.25 a bottle. I mean, China Glaze, you pretty much can't beat it in mainstream for how inexpensively you can get it. Now, of course, they're not the best formulated, so. But there are some fun colors in here, especially that purple uh, right there, the one with the strong green glow is really, really good. That's the one called Bloomphoria. Um, I also really like this pink, but just don't listen to me tell you right now. Go watch the review and give it a thumbs up. Um, <laughs> if you want to buy anything here, you can get it at Polish Pick. I feel like you can get a lot of what I got recently at Polish Pick. No, that's not true. This was, this was at Ulta. This you can get at headtotoebeauty.com. Um, is this a polish pick? I can't remember. Polish pick. I'm just pointing out how you can do like one-stop shopping from a bunch of different stuff at the same time. You know, you know, not that. <laughs> this collection I did not love. This simple colors collection. I only put up five of the images on my Instagram because I was like, hmm, not loving it. Not loving it. Okay. Do, 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 do. Okay, this one's for China Glaze. Ready, set, go. Who's going to yell bingo? I haven't been to bingo since like maybe a year and a half before COVID. What was the last time Tim and I went on date night? I think I'm going to take Tim to that movie Uncharted for date night. We haven't had a date night since Hawaii, so we need a date night. Has anybody seen Uncharted? Did you like it? I want to go see Death on the Nile for obvious reasons, but Timmy don't want to see that, so yeah. Hi, Isabel. Hi, Gail. Hey, Anna Jean. Randy, hi. Pulse is here. Pulse in the house. Pulse in the house. I might be a little hyped this morning. It's okay. Don't worry about it. I'm hyped up because it's my daughter's birthday party and she's going to have so much fun. She's getting so tall, you guys. She's only like three inches shorter than me on her. She's getting so tall. It's like going to be a problem. Not really. Not really. I'll handle it, but you know what I mean. Well, polish remover. I just used the big thing of acetone from Sally Beauty. And then I pour my acetone additive in it from Moonshine Manny. 
and that's what I use and I've been using it for three years now and it's my tried and true okay so you your brother just saw Uncharted and he said it was really good oh Louise come see the movie with me I want to I need some girl time you're gonna pull out your death on the Nile and go see it to the movie so fun uh Chrissy I am 5'4 and I was never taller than my mother. I basically got the same exact height as her. But do your children stop respecting you when they're taller than you? Lincoln's like almost a foot taller than me. <laughs> but he probably doesn't respect me anyway. Because he doesn't care about people. But I'm still taller than Salem actually. Shh. But Honor's going to be much taller than Salem. Okay. We have to pick from one of these million greens guys what am i gonna do what am i gonna do which one should i swatch uh, okay i gotta swatch the fancy glass one this is fancy rose 2.0 and this is like um a 2.0 version of their polish pickup which i guess um sold out and so maybe she made one that's similar for her website here we go it's just so beautiful in the bottle already and then so the warm state is that olive color and then as or excuse me the cold state and as it gets warm we shall see what happens okay for blue let's swatch this polished for days 2022 per your request did you start at 11 30 or 12 30 i started at my time 10 o'clock so that would be noon Eastern time, that would be 9 o'clock um, Pacific time. And Louise, you can tell me what time that is for just over the pond. So far, this is not shifting on me. We shall see. I'm not, I'm not warm enough yet, which I'm always warm. So, okay. So, as anticipated, this is a super glowy. Um, Basically, it has a blue base, but there's so much glow in it that you can't really see the blue. So it's just, the reason I was kind of like on the fence with this is because <laughs> I love a glowy gold shimmer. And so I have quite a few now. Oh, you can see the blue when you put it like this and look at the angle. <gasps> Beautiful blue. So I'm really glad I got it. I don't know if this is still available. Okay, so you can see on here, it's shifting to the rose color from here. And then when the rest of my finger warms up, it'll turn all, all rose. Oh, it's so pretty. It's so pretty, so pretty, so pretty, so pretty. Okay, purple. We're going to do this one from the Sanrio. It's called Choco Cat. Not currently available anymore. In fact, I think I accidentally or like somehow magically grabbed this um, trio after they were meant to have shut off the website for that day. I was so lucky because I had forgotten to order and then I saw the Instagram post that said closing at noon and I looked at it and it was like 1230 and I somehow was still able to order. I was super lucky. I just love it. The soft purple and then the beautiful glowy gold flakes and then the black micro uh, flakies. And now we need a neutral. So let's get down to business. Okay, I got a gray for the neutral. This is called Punk Rock Rainbow, and it is gray with a rainbow of glitters, and it's from Painted Polish. If you like mauves, she just came, oh, look at, look at the thermal one. She just came out with a new collection full of mauves. 5'4", and you're, and he's 6'4". When he was eight years old, oh my gosh. Yeah, ouch. My daughter's not that tall, but she will be. She's just not that tall yet. But she will pass me up in the next year and a half, probably. Which would be good for basketball. Okay, cute. 
cute, cute, cute. Okay, ready for the stop? You love the PFD glowy one. I know, look how glowy. It's like blinding. Okay, you love painted polish. Yay! You wore this one? The punk rock rainbow? That's very you, Louise. I have to say. I have to say, that's kind of like Louise in a bottle. Okay. 45. We're looking for 45. That's for the China Glaze Mystic Bloom Collection. I'm very thirsty today. Sorry. Okay. Back to the Fancy Gloss. Let's get Fancy. It is really beautiful. I wish I were leaving this hand on for the rest of the day, but we're going to swatch some more stuff. So pretty. Doo, doo, doo. The cap is not wanting to cooperate, but I don't know if this is still available. If anybody knows, you can let the chat know. But I got this on the Fancy Gloss website. How close is Choco Cat to Even Tide Embrace? Um, pretty close in color, but that polish isn't available anymore. But um. Even Tide Embrace only has multi-chrome flakies in it, and this one doesn't have any. This one has black flakies that don't shift, and then it has Bob. <laughs> it has Bob in here. They're going like a, basically the shift you see there is in the flakies in Bob. So, close, but I would still want both because I love purple polish, so... I also love Even Tide Embrace. Thank you for reminding me about that polish. I love it. Do, 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 do. And Luther! Woot woot, Nicole! Congrats, girl. Now you have to choose which ones are your faves. Always the hardest part. Okay, so you guys, you guys, um, the next giveaway is going to be for Moonshine Manny. I want to show you the new stuff that's coming out next Friday. So we're going to have some new releases on Friday and then Saturday is our mix along, right? Let me check my phone. And it's going to be Encanto. Encanto won the poll last Saturday. If you don't like Encanto, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. But we're still going to have a lot of fun. And Tim's going to be dressed up as Mirabelle. So um, I think you'll have a lot of fun if you come, even if you don't like Encanto. It's going to be next Saturday, same time as today. This one was a little, a little much for my nail. I put on too much. There we go. Um, it's going to be at 9 a.m. Pacific, 12 o'clock Eastern. Louise, did you say what time it was where you live? I think you said it's like 5 p.m., right? Um, ooh, this shift is not going to be for everybody, but it's so cool. It's so cool. And then she has just like a ton of Pinkie Pie in there, which is the flaky. I just like to name it that because you guys, a lot of you know what shift that is. It's going... Um, a nice bright like neon looking pink to orange to gold okay I have to take these off I'm so sad I'm so sad they have to come off though okay so next Friday we have the next Facebook group exclusive designed by my friend Jalen my swatcher Jalen she's at got nail on Instagram because she very narrowly won the poll it was almost a tie between her and Shayna's image and I love Shayna's image as well um, that was the one called, well, I think it rocks. It was, it was very close, but I also am launching that day a limited edition shade from Honor. And I don't, I don't like to do duos if I can help it just because I already feel like, um, my swatchers are just so wonderful and they all are just so sweet to swatch stuff for me. And I know that some swatchers take on more than they probably have time for because they love polish so much because that's how I was. And so I don't want to like stress them out with too much to swatch. So 
I was like, oh, should we do a duo? No, we'll just do the one. So let me grab it. Um, there's something else launching that day. The MSN come back. So we'll have, um, I'm telling you this because if you win this next giveaway, you could wait and tell me what you want on Friday if you want any of the new stuff. Wakanda Forever is back for a limited time. So MSM comebacks this year are going to be one batch comebacks. So if you're somebody who voted for it to come back, make sure and grab it while it's back. Because I base it off of you guys' votes and like what you ask for. So this polish is really cool. This one has the flaky in it that I call Hydraxy and Waterlord. I know that doesn't mean anything to you, but it's a beautiful pink, blue, purple flaky. And then it has a shimmer in there that goes fuchsia to gold. And it's, it's really beautiful. So this was a Facebook exclusive once upon a time. And um, I'm sure you know the inspiration. So here is the Facebook exclusive for February. And this was the one that was called Mr. Cellophane on the images. And so it has this tealy base and then the shimmer in there shifts between all the other colors that were in the image. So we have pink, purple, blue, gold, green, and then the teal is in the base. And this is a um, iridescent shifty shimmer in here with a linear hollow. So um, I can just show you guys what this looks like real quick. So this is called Boho Soul, and it's going to be available for about three weeks. And if you're wondering, this is a sister formula to Joy's Rock Candy. So there's that. Once you build it up in two coats, you'll get a nice blinding iridescent shift and lots and lots of hollow. So then... Uh, we'll I'll just watch this one too, so you guys know if you don't, if you aren't familiar with Wakanda Forever. It's a black base with all the shifty flakies and the shimmer in there. And it, the formula did not change. It's not a 2.0. It's the same exact formula. In case you're wondering. So there will be some images from last time because it didn't change and then on her special polish she makes a polish every year for her birthday like joy does and last year she did honors key lime pie this year she did honors basketball season so she picked her favorite color right now at as the base which her favorite color has been blue for years and years and years and just this last year it switched to lavender which is very pleasing to me because I love this color. So she has Pinkie Pie Flakies in there and then she has um, glitters the color of her uniform, which is white and like a maroon. And so she's got like some, some cherry to maroon colored glitters in there. So that's called Honors Basketball Season. So I'm not gonna double coat these. So I don't wanna take up too much time, but this is what's coming on Friday. And then on Saturday, we'll make all of our Encanto polishes. So if you want to wait to claim your prizes, however, um, some of the new polishes from the Primetime Lover Season 5 are in the last call section. Some polishes that aren't having their batches remade are Lucy, you've got some splaining to do, Toit Nups, and I Became Obsessed With You Forever. So if those are things you wanted to snag before they're gone, you might want to grab those. Um, before they retire. So, something to think about. Okay, this is for MSM. Ready, go. Wakanda is back. Oh, thanks, thanks. Yeah, she has so much fun. Don't forget, me, we submit images for March Facebook exclusive on Tuesday. So, yes, the last day to pick up um, Tennessee Twinkle, which is sitting right it was sitting right here. Why do I always do that to myself? Oh my gosh, you guys. It was sitting right here. Tennessee Twinkle is so beautiful. I love it so much. And the last day to get it is Monday. At, and it retires at noon. Okay, we're back to red. We're back to red. 
Let's do this beautiful Penelope Luce. This is called Gori Gorilla. Garia. Garia. Polish ba Gamers Box exclusive January. I'm sure I'm saying that wrong, so please excuse me. Hi, L. I'm seeing some of you who are just hanging in and not chatting, and that's totally fine. I just want to say hi. Ooh, so pretty. You guys know I'm a big Penelope Luce fangirl now. I always have to pay attention to what she's doing at these events because it's always amazing. So there's that shade. Let's find a pink. This one's pink. This says November 2020. Oh my gosh. This has been waited to be swatched for so long. I have no idea if this is still available. This is from Native War Paints. And it's a magenta base with glitter and multi-chrome flakes. Or actually it just looks like purple metallic flakes. Pretty. That one's called November 2020. Okay, the struggle for finding orange polishes, guys. Um, da -da -da -da, da -da -da -da, Note to self, get more orange polishes. All right, I don't think it's gonna happen. So we're gonna swatch this. It has a little bit of orange in it. This is Carolina's ninth year anniversary polish, which might still be available. Let's swatch it. Have you had any international shipments come back to you? No, they were shipped crazy places. And then Kim, did they end up getting there eventually? I have no international packages come back, but I have had packages rejected when I go to ship them because I can't ship to Australia right now. I've been, I've just been thinking, oh, that's going to clear up by the next time somebody orders from Australia. No, nope, 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 nope. Okay. For gold, we're going to swatch this ILMP called Sun Glow. Sun Glow. November 2020 was a terrible month for you. <laughs> yeah, that was like, was it 2020 the year that Tim got sick? Yes, that was also a terrible month for me. That was the month Tim almost died. <sighs> and I know a lot of people lost people that month. And I am very grateful that he didn't die. <sighs> Beautiful polish, terrible, terrible month. Yes. Okay, so here's these four shades. We're going to one was return to the maker. 2020 equals a trash can. Hi, Wendy. Okay, here's your stop. I'll tell you what's on my nails again in just a second when we do the Wendy you got in there just in the nick of time. You've been wanting this ILMP perfect. The third winner is 17, 17, 17. Ivana just in the, in the nick of time too. Okay, so you're looking for the closest to 17 without going over. Now, to go over again what's on my nails. This is Penelope Luce and it's called Garia. I'm sure I'm saying that wrong. Do I need to roll my R's that are in the middle of that word? Garia. <laughs> I'll be a dork today, so you don't have to if you don't want to, okay? And you can get all your dorkiness out of the way by hanging out with me. Do, 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 Okay, November 2020. November 2020. No. At first, for a second, I thought there that was going to be a thermal. Oh, I'm sorry, Riley. I'm sorry. And then it just continued to get worse. I'm so sorry. Oh, this is a magnetic. Ah, it says it right on the right on the top there too, so I wouldn't forget. Let me find the magnet. Ah. 
It's sitting right under my nose and I can't see it because my whole table is covered in polish. But the magnet is somewhere around here. Hey magnet, there you are. Okay. Okay, don't wanna not apply the magnetic superpower to the anniversary shade. Let's do it. Let's do it, let's fall in love. Okay. Here we go. Let the superpowers combine. Let the cat eyes combine. Ooh, look how pretty. Basically it pulls all that green to one spot and it leaves that red, beautiful red base under there. <gasps> That's so pretty. That's so pretty. Gorgeous. Gorgeous, Carolina. You rock my socks, girl. And that shimmer that's pulled into the middle is going green, blue, purple. Gorgeous. Okay. Awesome. And you even educated fleas to do it? Okay, we have Jerry as the winner. Congrats, Jerry. Why did you pick 17? Was that your favorite year of life? Just kidding. <laughs> was anybody's favorite year of life 17? I don't know. I still really did not know who I was at all at 17. I don't know if I could call it my favorite year. That's a really pretty, really, really pretty gold. Okay. Okay. Say goodbye to these. Jerry, I'm writing you down, girl. I'm going to write you up. Okay. Next is going to be grab bag one. So, all things that we just swatched, so you know how they apply. Okay, you remember this beautiful red? <gasps> For those of you who were drooling over this Paradox polish, it's in here. This cupcake golden holographic, this polish called Louise is right here. Just kidding, it's called Punk Rock Rainbow. And then November 2020, I'm sorry, it's a beautiful polish, I didn't mean to laugh. But if you love pink, just wear it and forget what it's called, okay? So that is gonna be grab bag number one. So if you see in there something you like, if you can tell it's a bunch of shades that you don't like, don't enter unless you plan to give it away as a gift. <laughs> but if you like something, enter. And I hope you win. Okay. Taking off the polish, time to pick another green. Which one shall we pick? Which one in the fountain, each one seeking happiness. Did you guys see that there's a new Elvis movie coming out? I'm really excited. Um, it's from Boz Lerman, and I'm really excited. I watched the trailer this morning, and it looks intense and beautiful, and I hope it's really, really good. Almost ready. I'm gonna swatch that neon fair maiden because I just gotta. I just gotta, and it's called Hop to It or something. Hop to it. Yes, hop to it. I can't believe I remembered. Hop to it. And I swatched this already. I almost just tried to swatch that purple again. How dare I? Okay. Hop to it from Fair Maiden from the Sanrio. Okay, this polish would benefit from a white base. It's gorgeous on its own. It doesn't require a white base. It's just the color that is in the bottle is gonna look like actual that if I wore a white base. So, it has um, blue to purple shimmer in there and then it has Pinkie Pie and it's gorgeous, like a whole little rainbow in there. So cute. Okay. Let me grab a blue from a brand we didn't already swatch. I love you always, Aaron, near and Fox, so stood together forever. I will get you everything. Oh, that is 
not a blue, but that is very interesting. Also not a blue. Here we go. That one works. Now let me grab a purple. That one works. Okay, we're good to go. Oh, well, actually, maybe it is kind of blue. Oh, well, we'll save it for neutral. So, here's this blue. And I saw it on my girl, Jessica, the polish queen. I saw this on her nails. It's called Rise Up. And it's, what are we talking about? You guys are, you had a lot of crises at this age of 17. <laughs> the pinky pie. Okay, this is from KB Shimmer and it's from a few polish pickups ago. And it's like a sheer, like, white cadet blue like it has a lot of white in it but it's really densely packed with red copper gold multi-chrome shimmers so that's going to build up nice in two coats even though it's a sheer base okay for purple we're going to swatch alchemy lacquers lord of the dead from polish gamers box 2021 december lord of the dizzy <laughs> so Vicky, this is what my polish room looked like. I'm hitting the green screen right now. That's what my polish room looked like when I went, lived in California. And when I moved here, I decided to no longer allocate a room of my house to my polish and filming room, but to make it my workroom for Moonshine Manny. Um, more dedicated towards the workroom. So I really miss my shelf wall of polishes and I miss not when back in the old days when I didn't use a green screen for all my videos because it's kind of annoying, but it makes my room more functional for Moonshine Manny. So it's the toss up that needed to happen. Like it's a trade, the trade up that needed to happen, but I still miss it. So yes, that is a green screen, but it is a picture of my actual wall that I had up. Guys, how long did I have that wall up? Like most of my channel, not the first year, maybe not the first two years, but then the next five, pretty much. <laughs> One good thing about 2020 counseling and antidepressants. <laughs> oh man. Okay. So for neutral, we have this thermal from Trio it's really hard to read her label, Trio Trio Lacquer. And it's called Gotta Go Plum, and it's from the Mario Polish Gamers box. May 20, oh my gosh. This is officially the oldest thing we've swatched today. Sorry, Gotta Go Plum, I don't, we'll have to see you guys. Do we think that this thermal's gonna still shift after two whole years sitting in my, it is a cold room that it sits in. So we'll have to see if there is blue and red bright glitters in the base. We shall see. You keep your polish and helmers. I keep a lot of polish and helmers. It's just that my stuff for Swatch Fest, I don't. That helps me know what I've swatched and what I've not. The black floating shelves. Oh my gosh, yes, Kristen, when I was pregnant with Joy. That was when I just first started my channel. Kristen, you might be with me since like month two. Me and you, we go way back. Okay, the number is 40. 40 for grab bag number one. And next we'll do grab bag number two. And then we're going to send you guys on your way. Are you guys doing anything fun today? You can't wait to see if it works. I know, right? Me too, Jessica. Is it going to work? Riley, you too? Me and you is old time buds, huh? Where are the OGs? Where are my OGs at? Okay. So, like I said, this color doesn't need a white base, but see how you can still see most of my nail under there? So, I like that this polish is on the sheer side because, um, in fact, say goodbye. I'm going to put white underneath. I like that it's sheer because you can see all the beautiful shimmer and flakies. 
but it makes it just a little bit tricky to wear on its own. So we're just gonna make it pop now. We're gonna go in with some blank slate and we're gonna make it pop. Mm -hmm. There's a little bit of fuzz that was on my nail from taking off the polish. Okay, so we're gonna let that dry for a second. Okay. So we're gonna let that dry for a second. You love sheer bright greens. Awesome. Chrissy has a pool tournament. Awesome. I hope you whip everybody's butts. All the girls and all the boys. You remember Toddler Joy? Aw. And it wasn't lives yet. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Back when I had a little more time on my hands, believe it or not, when I had a baby, I had more time on my hands. <laughs> but that was before Moonshine Manny. Okay, there's that gorgeous KB Shimmer. That is really something, guys. Now we have, I keep wanting to call this the Sands of Giza. Lord of the Dead from Alchemy Lacquer. Really, really cool. Too cool for school, that's for sure. It takes my breath away. And I overloaded it. Okay. Pretty darn cool. That is so much shimmer in there. That's so pretty. Okay, so I think the thermal's still working, guys, because I think it's supposed to go from that blue, like dark blue gray to a clear. So I think the thermal's still working. Did you guys find the winner? Did I even say stop? Did I say stop? Let's see. Let's see. Did I say stop? Yes, I did. Okay, we've got, oh, we've got a little bit of discrepancy. Let me see what Louise says. Louise says it's Hannah. Okay. Whoop, whoop. Hannah, yay! What are you gonna pick? So exciting. Okay, grab bag number two. Let me finish swatching what is on my nails. We're gonna do this trio lacquer, gotta go plum. How often do you say this phrase during your week? Gotta go plum. I mean, <laughs> when we were having plumbing issues about two months ago, I said that once in a while, actually. Gotta go plum. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, oh man, this white is really boom. Yes, congrats to Hannah. What an awesome sawsome. Do 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 do. Okay, here we go. This is going to be hop to it over white. It doesn't look exactly like the bottle in one coat. In two coats, it will, I believe. Whee! It burned your eyeballs. It's so pretty. What watch? Oh, good job. My friend finished her workout. Do you guys follow your friends on your on your on their workouts on their phone? Pfft, watch. I like it. It's fun and motivating. Okay, we have to say goodbye. Goodbye. Okay. Does anybody know what that's from? Do you know what that's from? Do 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 do. Okay, I'm gonna pick one color and paint. Actually, no, we're gonna swatch some more because I really need to swatch some more. So we're gonna start the last giveaway in just a second. 
I'm going to swatch some more from my blue green bin, I think. Oh, that one had a lot of glitter on it. Come on, little glitters. Come on, glitters. Okay. So let's do, I think I'm gonna do somebody's idea and swatch a bunch of greens. That's gonna be fun. Okay, let me grab some greens really quick. fun greens. Okay, let me get one more that's a different brand. Ooh, okay, this is going to be fun. The hills are alive. <laughs> okay. All right, grab bag number two. Here are your choices. We have KB Shimmer Rise Up. We have this Karobi inspired green from Fair Maiden. We have this Alchemy Lacquers that is seriously so stunning. <sighs> we have this Trio Lacquer Thermal that lasted the test of time. And Penelope Loose Red. Okay? So that is what is in your grab bag. Number two, final giveaway of the day. Good luck to everybody. Ready, set, go. Your favorite nail polish color to wear is green. Hey, Paul, love for polish Zama. Okay. So that's number two. Put that right over here. So it is separated from grab bag number one. Okay. So exciting. Okay, so we're gonna do a polish green, night owl lacquer green, bee's knees. No, I thought this was bee's knees for a second. It's MTK. MTK and we're gonna do so let's go in order from lightest to darkest. So we're gonna start with this Night Owl Lacquer. Look at how awesome. Not inclined to resign to maturity. That is making me think of a movie Tim and I watched last night. There's a movie on Amazon Prime. It's kind of newish. It's called I Want You Back. And it is um, a romantic comedy with Charlie Day from Always, Funny in, uh, Always Sunny in Philadelphia. Jenny Slate, who is that really hilarious girl on Parks and Rec. And then it has, is her name Gina Rodriguez from Jane the Virgin? And then Clint Eastwood's son is the other main person in the show. And the, it didn't have like a super great rating. It was like a 6.5 out of 10 or something. But Tim and I enjoyed it. We liked it, so... I recommend that first one is not resigned, not inclined to resign to maturity. And that might still be on her website because it's not a polish pickup. This is little olives from polish. This was exclusive to the, um, olive polish Facebook group. It is not currently available. So I'm sorry, but we're going to swatch it because I bought it and I want to swatch it. I want to know you. Ooh. Ooh. So nice. Now we're going to swatch Say It Ain't Cilantro. She has an R for reflective. You can see how reflective it is because of the lights work well. My um, ring lights are kind of like flash lights, so you can see it's reflective. Yay, excited. Yes, it's from the movie Ebony. I like that song a lot. Okay. For you cilantro lovers like me, we have... Tim linked me another taco place for us to try. I love going to try street tacos from different places, you guys. But... This weekend will probably not be the weekend for it because we're going to do what Honor wants to do. Jenny Slate is also Marcel the Shell. I don't know who the, who is Marcel the Shell. She also plays the, um, the sheep on Zootopia. 
And guys, you know what I realized yesterday? Encanto is like on every every kid's mind right now. So it's like taking the world by storm. But remember how Disney had just barely released that one Raya and the Last Dragon? That movie got like zero hype. And had a pretty exciting story. And I was just remembering that. Like I think we watched that one time and then we didn't ever watch it again. Okay, so here's all the greens. This MTK was called Heart of Spring. It's really cool. It's a really swampy green with lots of red, gold, orange elements. And it's gorgeous. This is very, <laughs> this is pretty similar to, I wish I could, but I don't want to. But she's got some other things in there as well. And this was from, oh, it's a thermal. <gasps> I have to wait and see. It was from January 2021. Oh, so I just barely, no, that was 2022. This is a year old thermal. So we shall see if it's gonna switch, okay? The reflective glitter is so dark when there's no light on it. Okay, so here's your stop. We're gonna choose a winner. Can March theme mix along be spring fling? We'll have to vote on it again, huh? Okay, so the final winner of the day is number 62. It was criminally underrated. It was really, really good, huh? Huh. Learning something new, Kristen, from you. You need to watch Raya and the Last Dragon Ant. I'm going to put a Moonshine Manny green on my thumb so that we have, so all my thumbs are green. This is a super sneak peek from a new polish coming up in March from my Ono Hawaii collection coming in March, inspired by all the delicious food I ate. Ugh. So this polish is inspired by this pesto spaghetti that I actually had for breakfast one day and it had shrimp and macadamia nuts and it was incredible and I called this polish pesto macadamia nut sunrise because I had it for breakfast and it has a sunrise shimmer in it and it was one of my favorite things I had there pesto breakfast spaghetti with macadamia nuts in it it was so good <laughs> So now we're all full of greens. There we go. Okay, so did you guys find 62 yet? 62! Marcel the Shell is a stop motion video series and it's so funny. Oh my gosh, really? Where do I watch it, Leslie? Tell me where to watch it. This green is just so cool. She has these micro metallic flakies in here that it's making it glow. It is so cool. I don't have anything like this. Wow. I loved the collection that this was from. Every single one of them was outstanding. Go check it out if they're still available. I don't know, but hopefully. Hey, we have Leanne Angel. Awesome. Exciting. Okay, I'm going to finish watching these. So this is Polish Little Olives. So this is a dusty green with lots of iridescent shimmer um it looks like probably the same shimmer that's in 2022 that we swatched at the beginning of the video and then it has hollow flakies and then we have say it ain't cilantro which actually went on kind of patchy on the first coat but i think we're going to level it out really nicely and then i'm going to add two coats of top coat because reflective polishes are top coat eaters so you either want a glitter top coat, like a glitter food, or just use a couple coats of top coat because we want it to stay looking like that. Oh, it's so beautiful. I just got to go get me some cilantro today. All right, what do we think about this MTK Thermal? Did it, is it shifty? Looks like it might have kind of shifted up here at the top. But I want to wear it all day and see what happens. It is gorgeous. Probably one of my favorite MTKs I have, actually. That is so pretty. It's just so, there's so much red, like orangish red in there. It's so cool. Basically, this is like an orc. This is an orc in a polish. That's what I think. Okay, guys, look at these. Oh, I need to do another coat of this. <laughs> 
I'm so excited I get to wear all these greens the whole day. I really love the idea of having like a matchy hand to finish off Swatch Fest with. Okay. And then the last one is Pesto Macadamia Nut Sunrise going on the thumb. And it is super fun and shifty. And don't forget to join me and Tim next Saturday for our mix along, our Encanto theme mix along. We're going to have to only pick four things to be inspired by. That is going to be really, really tricky, but I believe in us. We can do it. Thumbelina. Okay. Just capping everything to make sure I don't lose anything to the evaporation gods. Can't wait for the Encanto mix along. You wonder when Zoya is launching their spring collection. Jessica says, I'm wondering where you're all from. You love the green hand. Me too, Jackie. Yas, green queen. Loving the Gilded Age. Guys, I'm trying to decide if I need to resubscribe to HBO Max for the Gilded Age. Do I need to? Mm, coriander is a Greek and cilantro is a Spanish word. Oh my gosh. You're not a first time winner, but you're from Maryland. Woo! Where are Tika's from? Fair Lawn, New Jersey, says Kayla. Love the fashion, Jacqueline. Oh, no. I love the fashion. Do I need to watch this show? Bye, Vicky. Thanks for coming. Aw, you're welcome, Kim. Thanks for coming. Okay, friends. I will see you. I hope to see you all back next um, I literally have a green thumb. I know, right, Vicky? And I don't have a green thumb. Oh, I need to put top coat on all of these before I forget. Okay, next weekend in Kanto. And bring all of your good ideas. And we can have um, a post. If somebody wants to start a post in the Moonshine Mini Facebook group for our Maryland fam. Oh, I love that. Um, Rachel's from Nevada. Jerry's from Florida. Boris says she's from the Northeast USA. Um, Jersey Shore from Maryland, Arizona, Chrissy. Um, let's start a post in the Moonshine Manny group for Encanto Inspo for our mix along next week, okay? You're welcome, Nicole. Can't wait to see what you guys pick. Vicky's from Maryland also. So much Maryland fam. Okay, guys. So much love. Have a great weekend. I'll see you back next weekend. And I will miss you guys till then.